Well, you know, we've got a quarterback back from last year. We got five starters on offense. We have four starters on defense. So not a ton of experience coming back, but we have a lot of seniors who have a lot of experience in the program. Um, you know, and, and we feel like, you know, this could be a team as we develop throughout the season. It could be could be a very good football team. Mm -hmm. Have you seen Drew Miller? You know, you mentioned him. Have you seen him grow from, you know, last year? It was junior year, right? Mm -hmm. So have you seen him grow since then? You know, I think any time a quarterback has two and even three years in your program as a starter, there's a lot of advantages there. And I've seen him grow as far as decision making. That's probably the number one thing, you know, making good pre-snap pre decisions, deciding where that football needs to go, his reads in the run game. But, uh, you know, it, having him back as uh, as an experienced player is, you know, certainly beneficial to our football team. Mm -hmm. You know, you mentioned him. Are there any other guys that kind of stick out to you as, like, stuck out as good leaders so far in the top team? Yeah, I mean, we, we've got a lot of good leaders. I hate singling out seniors because I think our whole senior class is great leaders, and we're going to be counting on them an awful lot this year to have a successful year. They've waited their turn. A lot of these guys are going to get their chance to start this year and, and be leaders. And, you know, Drew comes back with experience, and, you know, Jack Kleba comes back with experience experience and Trevor Cobb comes back with some experience as does Corbin Fisher you know the, and, and but you know we, we we're just blessed with a lot of good you know another Trey Bexton comes back with a lot of experience uh, we're blessed with a lot of good senior leaders and I, I'm, I'm just looking forward to you know getting on the field and, and start playing and it, it's been a good summer we had a good good attendance in the weight room almost 95 percent attendance in the weight room this summer I'm really proud of their effort and you know I, I've always said that pays dividends when the season starts the work that you put in in the summer well first week can Obviously, big matchup. You know, you think of Aeneas Williams, all those guys. Uh, what are you looking at at that matchup? I know it's early, but you know, how do you prep for a big week on matchup? Well, like you know, uh, that that obviously has our attention. It is our first game, and you know, probably the best athlete that we're going to play all year in Aeneas Williams. And so, we'll, you know, we'll certainly have to game plan and scheme to try to slow him down a little bit. They're a very talented team, a state finalist team from last year. So, you know, we'll, we'll be ready when that August 26th date comes around. Awesome.